Today, I'm excited to introduce our new extension, Remove Inactive Friends for Facebook. You can use it to analyze each friend's interactions with your posts and easily remove inactive friends. Let me show you how it works. After installing the extension, click on the extension icon and then click open the app in the pop-up. Let's click Start Sync to begin analyzing friends. If it's your first time using it, please check Posts and Friends. The extension offers extensive configurations with explanations for each. Let me choose to fetch complete data and analyze for recent 21 posts. Now, let's get started. Let me quickly explain how it works. Once the synchronization starts, this extension will simultaneously read all friend data and recent post data. It will also read the reactions, comments, and share post data from each post. Finally, it will integrate them all together to analyze and identify inactive friends who have never interacted with your posts in any way. Let's continue back to the extension page. The synchronized data will update on the UI page in real time. You can see all the fetched friends in Friends tab. And you can go to the Posts tab to view the currently fetched posts. And also you can click the check button to view the original post. Let me fast forward. Great! The data has been successfully fetched. We can click on the score column to sort friends from high to low scores. Let me click on the comments column to see which post the friend left comments on. You can click on the links here to view the original posts on Facebook. Okay, let's select inactive friends on this page and sort them by the date they became friends. We can find those who have never interacted with any of my posts. Let me select the friends I want to delete and click the red button to start removing them. Fantastic! We have successfully removed 9 inactive friends. Let's go to the Removed History tab and take a look. Here are all the records of deleted friends. If you need to export these friends, check all of them and click the Exports button. Let me click Export to Clipboard and then paste them into a Google Sheet. Here we go! Thank you for watching!